Welcome to STEM Saturday. I'm Dr. Calvin Mackey. Yeah, I'm excited today about STEM Saturday, uh, the physics of sound, because sound and music play such a big role in our culture. We're going to show you how sound comes from different places, but we're going to show you the math and physics of sound. Next up, I'm going to bring my friend, our mayor, Latoya Cantrell, to bring greetings. I am so excited to welcome you to STEM Saturdays with STEM NOLA. We value STEM in the city of New Orleans, and I know that you do as well. So engage, get ready, have fun, because this is all created again for you. So now, Henry is going to bring to you some amazing activities. So let's do the sound bowl first. What's gonna happen is the friction created by my hands is gonna go into the handles, and that is going to vibrate this uh, sound bowl, creating some waves in the water. The singing pipe is gonna use some fire, all right? So it's gonna be exciting, but at the same time, we need to be careful because we're gonna heat up the air inside this. That air inside here is super hot, so I'm gonna turn it slowly. Okay, let it, give it a sec. Now the air is coming out. Sound is about vibration. And today you're gonna do a couple of activities to reiterate that. Also, I'll catch you second graders. You're gonna make a guitar and you're gonna be able to make your music. Third through 12th graders, you're gonna make a xylophone. And when you make your xylophone, make music. Can anybody tell me what a kazoo is? It's something that plays in music. Yes. So we're gonna make our own kazoo today. Your first step is you're gonna take your big rubber band and one popsicle stick. Hold it and then pull down and then let it go. You should end up with something like this. Very good. So you wanna take this big piece, screw that into the hole on your PVC cylinder. Next, you're gonna take your balloon, open it up, and you're gonna fit it over the top part. If we put the salt on top, what do you think the salt's gonna do? Shake or fly? Yes! And so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna make like a sound wave. We're gonna take our gummy bears, we're gonna put one on one side, we're gonna put one on the other side, all right? We should have tape on both sides of our skewers. <laughs> and then lay your skewers on top of that strip of tape. Whoa! This is a good visual representation of sound. So we're gonna move on to the guitar. And once you cut out the templates, the next step would be to just glue it on to the side. This is what's gonna be like our guitar part where the strings go along. And just drum a beat right quick. I love it, yes ma'am. My woman, my one woman band. We could go ahead and move on to the xylophone. So we're just gonna put them in order from shortest to longest. Good job, Delia. You got it. You did it to the top and you did it to the bottom, right? And so this is what the final product should look like. I think let's all play a song at once with our xylophone. Um, Three, two, one. <laughs> is it? I want to bring this into school and then I'll show my music teacher. <laughs> You would be so proud that you made your own xylophone. I do appreciate that um, it was a lot of activities. I know they do like you know various different projects and stuff at school, but nothing to the magnitude of where she gets to actually understand how things work and why. I love to build, so um, I enjoyed making the xylophones. For STEM NOLA to do some of the same things that had me really excited and encouraged to be an engineer. I wanted my boys to know about science, technology, engineering, and mathematics the same way that I learned. So kudos to STEM NOLA for putting a song for a New Orleans family. 